Hello everybody, I thought I'd do a quick tutorial on how to oil valves on a brass instrument. So first of all we must make sure we've got proper valve oil to do this job. Um, so no household oil is suitable other than instrument specific valve oil. You can buy it from Amazon or eBay or other online music shops uh, and you can get some from the music service. So. Um, the other thing I've got here is my kitchen roll and that's because I'm going to wipe the valves down before I oil them and therefore uh, hopefully achieve the best result. First things first, if your mouthpiece is in, you need to remove your mouthpiece so it doesn't fall whilst we're oiling the valves. And then the next thing we need to do is undo the valve that we're going to oil. I'm going to do the first valve here. So I'm just undoing the cap at the top. all the way like that and then the valve should pull out like that just pop the instrument back down so the next thing we need to do is clean the silver part of the valve remove any oil any muck that might be in there anything that will stop the valve from operating properly and then with my valve oil I'm just going to oil, put some oil on. In fact, I'll turn my hand around like that. Put some oil on to the silver part. There. Once you've got some oil all over the valve, pick up your trumpet, pop the valve back in, and you'll notice that the springs of the valve are 90 degrees to the instrument. And then the valve should go in, and if you just check by turning the valve, it should not turn, that means hopefully it's aligned in the right way. Now it's important to check this before you do the valve back up by just blowing through the lead pipe there of the instrument and checking that the instrument is free blowing, which it is. If you've put the valve in the other way around and you blow through, the valve um, will be blocked, the holes won't be aligned and you won't be able to blow through the instrument. If that's the case, you need to just lift the valve up and twist it, keep turning until you hear the click, like that, and check again, and the valve is free. It's really important that we only do one valve at a time, that way if the holes are misaligned then we can quickly work out which valve it is that you need to turn around and um, get them back in line so that the instrument is free blowing. Once you've done that, just do your valve top back up again. Test the valve and it's working really well and that's it. So if your second or third valve are sticking as well, then you can just repeat the process for those valves, but definitely do one valve at a time and always blow through to check. If the instrument feels blocked when you blow, then just turn the valve until you hear the click. Try again, still blocked, lift it up, give it a twist, hear the click, and the instrument is free blowing again. I hope that's helped and happy oiling.